You guys ready to rock? Okay. Without any further ado, I want to bring out right now teacher, rapper, hero, my man. His name is Random, but we more commonly know him as Mega Ram. The ruler's back. Seattle! some fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. I hear him talking, see him staring at me. I am who I am. I'll be what I be. And if that don't please you, I'm cool with that. Somebody out there say the ruler's back. I hear him talking, see him staring at me. I am who I am. I'll be what I be. And if that don't please you, the cool with that. Say the ruler's back. I'm a living miracle, street smart, lyrical, driving critics hysterical, living life empirical, risk it all, outcome bound to be terrible. You brag about doing stuff for your conference a year ago. Learned a lot like you can't argue with an idiot, it'll drag you to its level, beat you down with experience. Mild man and teacher, peace when I meet ya. Cats think it's sweet, so they ask me, feature. Then ran lazy down, like it's bent. Went from opening hack to cats begging them to head. So did y'all forget it? The man, well, apparently, thick glasses, Star Wars sees hell there with me. You were whack, stop rapping, you should act, move them back, like Cairo did, you were rap. Never thought I'd see the world, regularly I'm doing that. Konnichiwa, Pax, the roof is back. Hey, I'm talking, see you staring at me. I am who I am, I'll be what I be. If that don't please you, I'm cool with that. Say the rule is back. Yeah, hey, I'm talking, see you staring at me. I am who I am, and I'll be what I be. If that don't please you, I'm cool with that. Say the ruler's back. 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 Low classics. played a game called Castlevania Symphony tonight. I did a whole album about it, so now we're about to go deep into the darkness of Dracula's castle. One, two, three. No whip in my hand, mission in hand, hurting my heart and revenge in the plans. I cover my stance, everything's dark, dagger equipped and it's ever so sharp. Look to the enter to never depart, the most dangerous mission ever depart is in front of my eye. Castle so vast, but to become it and tackle my past. My father and man, my mother dead. Can't get the memory out of my head. Missing my steps, beat it by death. Who tells me nicely it's best if I left and he don't understand. Mission in hand, easy to repeat and that's why I stand. Do all I can, getting it in. Dracula's castle is risen again. Check it, Dracula's been resurrected. It's getting all kinds of hectic. And I get knocked out of death. Wish, yes, this one time. Now that this chase on my front line. Got this except for the blood line. I got the sever the blood line. My father rises, he's put back to rest. Demons are always equipped for the test. Talent, skill, test they possess. But check me out a whole different mess. These are your ticket, be sick if it's peace. These are these stormen, they're back in the sleep. Mission is wounds, but these is in murder. Jack of this castle, <laughs> let them return. These are your day, they're with the pie. Early in bed, early to rise. These are your hundred, now he's back in five. Anticipating the hero to rise. Don't understand, mission in hand. He's in the retreat, and that's why I stand. Do all I can. Take my place on the front line. I got the sever the blood line. Sever the blood line. Yeah, somebody in here put a hand in the air. Wave it around and go side to side. Yeah, wave it around and go side to side. Yeah, wave it around and go side to side. Yeah, somebody here put a hand in the air. Wave it on side to side to side. Yeah, wave it on side. Wave it around. Do my thing. Then we be down. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, 
right. I got to get all the other games that I love out of the way before I get to, you know, the game I love the most. Arkanoid. <laughs> what? It's a great game. Anywho, any role-playing game players around here? <laughs> any fans of um, role-playing games, particularly made by a company called Square Enix? <laughs> I call them Square Soft. I don't call them Square Enix. I'm just saying. <laughs> but I digress. Um, particularly a game in that came out in 1997 for the PlayStation console. Mm. It was not Xenogears, but <laughs> arguably the greatest uh, role-playing adventure game of all time. I'm talking about Final Fantasy VII. <laughs> Murdoch and I argue all the time about which one's better. And seven is best. Six. He loves six. Yes. I yes. love seven. Yes. We yes. battle. What was it, seven? Yes. Or yes. Thank yes. you, that's what I'm talking about. Anywho, seven had the greatest group of insurgents ever to ever blow up a Mako reactor. And you know who the name of that group is, right? Avalanche. Avalanche! They were so badass that I made a song about them. And it's called Avalanche. Would you like to hear it? Here you go. That was weak. Would you like to hear it? Let's go. Now, in order to make this work, we need that up loud, and we need everybody to get ridiculously ridiculous. And the way this is gonna work is, put a fist in the air, everybody. We need that loud. I need that up louder. I can't, I can barely hear it in my monitors. All right, the way to make this thing work is you have to say the word hey at the appropriate time. Let's try to. Hey, 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 hey. Keep it going now. Hey, sir, it's not a bit nervous. It's got a bit further to go by any means. Getting rid of my enemies. A D A L A N. I can't hear you. Hey, hey, not a bit nervous. No lip service. Got a bit further to go. Do what I gotta. Who what that got up? A D A L A N T A G. Do you sound now? It's a master company called Shinra. I don't know exactly what they get to. When I get control of my life stream, this can't let that continue. I don't care who they hurt, who they get jumped. From the whole plan that against us. Stay up like you join the resistance, or you wind up going against us. My name, Barrett Wallace. I'm no more para. Polarizing folks do submission, not fatal. Wish this world wasn't violent. It'll get worse than we allow it. I hear with a cannon for an arm and a mind with no more religious sonic. Represent avalanche. No toughs don't have a watch them scatter, man. With Barry Slano's battle plan. My people beside me, team will provide me with a bit of voice of reason. Big sweats, just seeing anybody in my way. We squeeze it. Get behind me, I'm leaving. Mom in the region, gotta be the highest treason. Came too far on the back now, and I'm not leaving till we either. Bring it to whoever one you can get it quick. President of Shin Bristol Fitz, it's our brother here, he ain't holding it. Here's your part, let's go. Hey, hey, not a bit. No, 
Let service got a bit further. Do what I gotta. Who want that problem? A V A L A N C H E. That's who we be. That's what I'm talking about. Good job, Pax. I feel like I'm watching a Seahawks game, 12 men. You know Who I mean? knew Final Fantasy could be so crunk, for lack of a better word? Wow. <laughs> Pretty awesome. Okay, so real quick, I'm going to tell you guys a quick story. Um, I used to be a teacher. Make some noise for teachers. Now, a few years ago, I quit teaching to chase my true love and calling which was rapping about video games. And now I'm at PAX rapping about video games. Anything can happen, ladies and gentlemen. So don't give up on your dreams. And that brings me to this story. I was uh, making music, sampling my favorite game, Arkanoid, as I told you. No, no, okay. It was Mega Man. Now, I was rapping over Mega Man beats for a long time, and um, that caught the attention of a company called Capcom. Sorry, it never gets old. And when they emailed me, <laughs> I got a little scared. I read the email and it said, hey guy, we heard that you are using our copyrighted material and you have colored Mega Man black and, <laughs> and you basically disgraced our company. No, they didn't say that part, but this is what I was, the way I was reading it. I'm like, oh my God, here we go. So I scroll down, and I'm like, here comes the lawsuit, right? And they said, don't worry. This is not a cease and desist. And I was like, wait, really? And then I scrolled some more, and they were like, we wanted to tell you that we at Capcom love it. I was like, excuse me? This has got to be a trick. He's like, no, no, no. We love it. And um, in fact, why don't you come on out? and we can talk about some things. I'm like, this is definitely a trap. <laughs> a trap! But, you know, I did it anyway. Uh, so I came out, and long story short, I'm very happy to tell you that the re end result of that meeting is that I entered an exclusive licensing agreement with Capcom, which was pretty crazy. So I'm very happy to tell you, it gets better, that as of that moment, Mega Ran is officially licensed by Capcom. Crazy. So, you know, I went on and I was like, wow, that gives me permission to like steal your guys' stuff, you know? <laughs> cool. So what I did was I went back to the lab and I went back to the old Capcom games and I found a game called Little Nemo the Dream Master. <laughs> nice. You must be old like me. I love it. So we did a track called Dream Master and it goes like this. Let's do it, Cap. All right, Kay Murdoch made this beat, so we're gonna have some fun with it. Let's do it like this. We're gonna split the crowd down the middle like this. And you guys are gonna say, hey, hey, and you guys are gonna say, all right. I'm gonna split it right here. I gotta split you two in half. I'm sorry, you must be dismembered now. No, I'm just kidding. But remember, hey, hey, all right. I'm gonna demonstrate. Here we go, Pax. Hey, hey, all right, hey. Once upon a time, before beats in the rise, before that was ever really random, there was a boy in the hood who always did good. The bullies on the block couldn't stand him. And on Christmas and birthdays, he got mad presents. So many he didn't know what to play with. He had Transformers, He-Man, Ninja Turtles, Star Wars. But G.I. Joe's were his favorite. He was so creative that if they didn't make the toy like he decided to create it, he put Storm Shadow's legs on Snake Eye's body, then they pop. Then he duct taped it. He made spaceships.
one time too. Hey, hey, come on. Hey, hey. So to save this kid look funny in school, that would be a colossal understatement. He had high water pants, Coke bottle frames, and a mouth full of orthodontic braces. His first girlfriend was named Christina Perez. Took her everywhere, and now the boy is so cool. But she dated him on a dead. Left him standing there with no clue, man. Kids can be so cruel. At the time when they couldn't love him any less. Mama went and go to vote the guy in ADS. Cause his mother felt this was the best way to keep him out of the street. Though they were penniless. Only child, she didn't want an empty nuts. And it's a healthier addiction than cigarettes. So it began. How did he escape the scene? He sat in front of that screen and changed his dream. Pause. Nice. Ladies Thank and you. gentlemen, Mega Ran. So I decided to make up a fictional story that I thought would get your, <laughs> your tug at your heartstrings a little bit, because that wasn't true at all. No, <laughs> just, just kidding. It was, yeah. But anyway, um, <laughs> so I'm going to have some fun with you guys now. I would like to do something called a freestyle. Yes. Has anybody here ever heard of a freestyle? <laughs> well, allow me to teach. Uh, freestyle is the art of impromptu rap, meaning that it was not previously rehearsed. And the only way I can prove to you that this was not previously rehearsed is if everyone in here takes out an item, takes something out of your pocket, even up top, I don't know, wherever you but are, hey, hold nothing, something up in the air. Nothing that'll get you kicked out of packs, please. Nothing that will get you kicked out. Oh, nice. Oh, NC Warrior. Okay. The low classics are back yes, in the place. Yes, give it up Would you like them. to give them something, something classic? All right. <laughs> Very cool. Okay, I'm gonna do, wow, this is gonna be epic. If anybody has any type of recording capabilities, you might wanna YouTube this. All right, wow. All right, all right. Keep your items up, I don't have a very good memory. But let's see, wow, we got a lot of busters. We got phones, 3DSs, all right. Hey y'all, when I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle, freestyle. freestyle. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle. freestyle. Freestyle, yeah, and you know that man, I'm in the jam, and my brother, Proto Man, yeah, and when I'm on this thing, you know I do it, spit mad fluid, and my flow is foolish, yeah, here's a glasses, and another one, that's what's cool, I got another one, and I have two on, so I say now, guys, I now have eight eyes, so I'll take these back and hand it to you, hope I gave you the right one, I'll bring it to you, yeah, random, see that's me, and I play weak rappers like a PSP, yeah, I used to like those for emulators, never been a hater or an imitator, yeah, and you know I keep it live, or he's got the keys, he's the designated driver, when I say freestyle, you say freestyle, 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 when I say freestyle, you say freestyle, 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 yeah, and you know I bring the right, I like the proto man, I always light up the night, yeah, and I get mad respect, cause after me, the proto men are coming next, yes, and you know I got them for ya, I like the 
classic Mega Man, not NC Warrior. Sorry, I'm not a warrior. But when I come through, I'm like the courier. Bring it to you. Yeah, it's like a slaughter. Now I'm richer because I got your quarter in my pocket. No, it's more than that. I'll hand it back to you. Now it's a quarterback. Yeah, and you know I got the planet. I go into who they swore with. I can't stand it. Yeah, but a little early on, I had Jimmy John's and they'll deliver just one sandwich. Yeah, now I gotta say, hey, everybody get packs this rap in the day. Yeah, and you know what I say? Wait, how does he have human legs? Yeah, got again. Again, I already mentioned Proto Man. Yeah, and you know that I be the best. I play rap rappers, just like this DS. And I see another one. Blast me, pass me, even you can street pass me. Yeah, if you play an Animal Crossing, I play that game way too often. Yeah, my name is Mega Ran. I made a town in that game and I call it Mega Land. Yeah, they can't stand me. It's like trying to play a nun in Cards Against Humanity. Yeah, because that's kind of foolish. But I hold this mic, you know I bring it to us. Do this, yeah. You know I got to find it. Buy one of my CDs and I'll sign it. Yeah, you know I got the pass. You can record this and I'll say, hey, that's cool. And you know I got the pass. I hope you not got alcohol in that flask. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle, freestyle. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle, freestyle. Yeah, and you know I got to be appealing. One day I like to travel to New Zealand. Yeah, and if you know somebody that can book me, call them, and then I will hook me. Yeah, and you know I do my thing. They put an orange tag around this, in case we didn't know that this was real. Cause it's not, but I rap on the spot. No my cotton shot, yeah. And you know they can't trust me. Oh, this is a Pokemon, I thought it was a ducky. Yeah, and then they can't trust me. When I'm on this microphone, they all disgust me, yeah. And you know I got to say this hand here, this is a first aid kit, yeah. And I gotta save it private for a second. I'm gonna see what's inside it. Hope this doesn't embarrass you. The fact that you're saying no makes me wanna do it more. Oh shoot, I know what he's using it for. Yeah, so I'm gonna hand this back to you. When I rap on the sand, I'm gonna back to you. Yeah, I get you open like a door hinge. Tried to fool me, giving me an orange. I know how to rhyme that. I rhyme around the block. You know I do it all the time, Jack. Yeah, why well, play? Hi, hey, make a ram. We getting busy on a Friday. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle, freestyle. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle. Freestyle, low classics, keep the beat on going. Gotta keep it bumping and you know we keep them open. And so, one more thing before I go. My name's Mega Ram, that's a freestyle flow. Peace. Play it too. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I don't the time. I haven't even done anything Mega Man related. Okay, guys, we gotta stop. Yeah. Bam. Give it up for the low classics one time. Is anybody here slightly immature? This is the song for you. This is a song called Grow Up, and it utilizes the Woodman theme of Mega Man 2. It's a very simple chorus. I need you to help me with it. I'm gonna say, I just can't seem to grow up. Said, I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? And you need to respond with, what? And you know what? What? And you know what? What? I'll tell you. you know what? Let's do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You can even clap a little bit. I just can't seem to grow up. I said, I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? I don't think I want to. One more time. Here we go. Just can't seem to grow up. I said, I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? I don't think I want to. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I was a youngster, maybe seven or eight. I'll be up late playing games. I was straight. Baby said I'm on the couch, trying to get a free gone. Passing level at the level, thinking I'ma be pong. Little did I know they didn't have.
of any ending. Every couple of levels went back to the beginning. Hard lessons are learned. I recovered fine. Then beat pitfall, got tired of trying. The alias came around, I had to get down. You didn't like it on my block, you're bound to get clowned. My game, Super Mario, I played it to death. First to get a hundred men, could get turtles on a step. Learned that from game bro, but it's a shame though. Nowadays, video games ain't the same, bro. Complicated, they're not worth the price. No, some, they're a lot like life. And that's why I just can't seem to grow up. Said I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? Good one. Well played, sir. All right, let's keep the Mega Man goodness going here. Um, arguably the greatest or most popular theme in Mega Man 2 is um, the one from the theme of this evil genius who is um, the final boss character in the game Mega Man, which is who? Dr. Wally. Now, I always wondered if Dr. Wally could explain himself, because I never really knew why this guy was so crazy. Um, and if I sat him down in the chair and I said, Dr. Wiley, please explain yourself. I feel like he would say, Vel! And then I would stop him and I'd be like, no, 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 no. Explain yourself in the form of a rap song. <laughs> and then that would be this song called Wiley. Let's do it, y'all. your life like it did for mine. Make some noise. Woo! One of the smartest in the world. Amazing advancements in the field of robotics. Money was no object, but he never felt the need to make a profit with projects. He had a best friend, Dr. Light, that could have changed the world if they had stayed together. Then they cop this turn a bit of rivalry, and one day it changed forever. While he started coming up, felt like it was second place. He was always runner up. He got sick of second place. Felt like it was Wally's turn to start coming up. The school held a contest, showing off technology and charting the progress. Wally and Light collaborated, but Light got all the accolades. Well, press, I guess. Wally had enough for that. Started acting up. Back to stuff. That was tough. We weren't relying it. That was the beginning of a mad scientist who might win some, but he just lost one. They were for one. That's not fun. The, the, the robot didn't have son, so we dated the robot and called his son Rock. Named for his love for music. Lab assistant, just his toolkit. Teenage boy, clumsy, clueless, always amusing. It was the blueprint. Didn't want Rock to be all alone. He but another robot named Roll. 
life was grand. Little did he know, Molly was coming back now. Help me out, say Dr. Wally. you a weird question. Is there anyone here who can probably identify themselves as a nerd? Nerds. Okay, so we're a little bit of like, nerds. I just asked you that so I could judge you. Nerds. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I, I, I wrote this song, this next song, after experiencing some things when I was like, wow, man, it's so cool that you can be a nerd and everything about nerd culture is everywhere now. Like, it's so cool. You can't go anywhere without seeing like, nerdy stuff. And I'm like, this is great, man. But um, me, when I was young, it wasn't so cool to like the things I was into. I was drawing, I was reading comics, I was doing a lot of things that were considered to be lame. And I got a lot of flack for that. And um, did anybody here get flack for liking things that they liked? Okay, so good, you can relate in this song. So this joint here is called, You Didn't Know. And now you know, so let's do it. And um, the track is from one of my favorite role-playing games, uh, a joint called Illusion of Gaia. And cool, yo, the earth and the womb theme. And um, so yeah, this joint here, now you know. Now you know. No, no. Yeah. You didn't know? It's cool to be a nerd, chic to be a geek, and it's sweet to be a freak. But if you've never been teased for something that you believe, then you can't relate to me. Said it's cool to be a nerd, chic to be a geek, and it's sweet to be a freak. But if you've never been teased for something that you believe, you can't relate. Last week I went into Macy's, saw a retro shirt section, and thought this is crazy. Transformers and Alpha them sitting right next to Ralph Lauren kind of tripped me out. Then I recognize it isn't how it used to be. I'm happy truthfully, because now the youth can be whoever they choose to be without fear of mistreatment or judgment by their peers. Yeah, now the glasses that I'll be called a geek for in a boutique store they want a G for. Got me on a defensive like a 3 4. I should be celebrating. I guess we scored. But they're calling us retro because we thought the past was the best and we don't want to let. Go. But no matter what, I just know exactly where I came from. So we'll never forget, yo. Yo, it's cool to be a nerd, cheap to be a geek, and it's sweet to be a freak. But 
But if you've never been teased for something that you believe, you can't relate, you didn't know. It's cool to be a nerd, chic to be a geek, sweet to be a freak. But if you've never been teased for something that you believe, you can't relate to me, to, to me, to who, to me, or to you, or, or to me, or to you, or, or to me. Yeah, it's for you. Maybe you were socially impaired. Maybe you talked a little slowly or you stared. Developed a fixation on the things for which you cared. Didn't have the nicest body or the newest gear. Wore braces that had nappy hair. I don't just relate to it, I was there. That was crazy cause they look at me funny cause I quit the job and expect music to make some money. And now because he profits off talent, the box that you keep him in is falling off balance. Facebook comments telling them keep it real. They cook ramen, these want a decent meal. Just remember who wasn't afraid to embrace his ways and it wasn't to get paid. Nah, it wasn't for critical acclaim. If no one ever liked it, I'd still do the same. Keep retro tees in my closet, but now when I'm out, 20 people recognize it. It's way too big to stop it. I rep my environment, I'll never be a product. Cause we the sacrificial lambs. Kids today, they'll never understand. So that's why I make these jams. Seattle, let me see your hands. You didn't know? It's cool to be a nerd, it's chic to be a geek, and it's sweet to be a freak. But if you've never been teased for something that you believe, you can't relate to me. Said it's cool to be a nerd, chic to be a geek, and it's sweet to be a freak. But if you've never been teased for something that you believe, you can't relate to me, to, to me, to me, or, or to him, or, or to him, or, or to you, or, or to you. A you, a you, a you, a you, you didn't know? Well, now you know. Does anybody like a show called The Big Bang Theory? Anybody into that show? I hate that show. Sorry. I'd love to discuss that with you later, how they're, they're using you and, and taking advantage of you. But for another time. But for now, if you didn't know, well, now you know. Oh, yeah, now you know. Yeah, and now you know. Now you know. Now you know. Thank you. All right, I got time for one more. Is anybody here in love or in like at the moment? Yeah? Ah, nice, nice, nice. Okay, I was in like with a very beautiful woman. Um, uh, she was a video game character. <laughs> what, why are you judging me? That's where the problem starts. Um, that was just the beginning of my problems. Her name was Splash Woman. And, oh, you heard of her? She's, she's pretty hot. But um, we, had, we had some very difficult decisions to make because we had three fundamental differences. Number one, she was a robot. I'm not really into the whole robot on human thing, so couldn't do it. Second, she lived underwater and I was between jobs, I couldn't afford scuba gear at the moment, so it was, you know, it was weird. Lastly, I found out that she was programmed for the sole purpose of destroying me. Now, if you've ever dated anyone whose sole purpose in life was to destroy you, <laughs> then you know it's probably gonna be a rough one. So, <laughs> unfortunately, I had to kill her. I know, this is where the story gets sad. But however, if you have a mega buster that you got from Capcom, please put it on. And at, at, at a very key moment in this song, I'm going to need you to hold it up because this is the story of Splash Woman. Let's do it, y'all. Again, my name is Mega Rand. Thank you all. Make sure you're like, if you're enjoying yourself, make some noise. Yeah. 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 Now, it takes place underwater, so what I'm going to need you to do is everybody put a hand up. Yeah, 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 man, yeah. Somebody here, make a wave like this. Yeah, make a wave like that. Yeah, make a wave, make a wave. But only do that for the chorus, yeah. This is a mission, not a small time thing. Got me on the case like I'm Sherlock. Home was my dome, got a messed up from what I've been seeing, what I've been hearing. Got me not knowing what to believe in. Reason, battling bosses, record is flawless, zero losses. I came across this stunning young piece who resided at the bottom of the sea. And she told me her name was Splash Woman, beautiful but deadly. She was mad, cunning, 
a voice that would soothe the savage. Beast, physique, way above average. Magic, the wish that got me in a spell. Got me on lockdown, sort of like a cell. But I'm on a mission and I can't afford a bell. Cause girl, I got a secret to tell. Become don't ever say this, don't ever say this, you're my favorite. Got to clip me silly, so be perfect, don't ever play with. Got to my favorite, won't you be my baby? Maybe we ain't got to buy this land. And we get a bike somewhere, my dear. And even though she knew the truth about Rand, had a feeling she would understand. Now lift up your hand. Thought I was in love before, but I love you more. Baby, come aboard and go away with me. I can make you see what you mean to me, and we can be. That feeling, feeling like I'm about to hit that ceiling. I can't cause this line with spikes. And when I reached the lair and it was time to fight, I couldn't do it. Pumped out like Ashton's victim. Started singing, I had to listen. It was lovely when she sang, the fish came, and all of a sudden the mission changed. Insane. Told me about a true purpose. She just saved it, no stuff fell through the surface. Few days ago, the contract expired. She was scheduled to be thrown into the fire. While they gave her a reason to live, and now she got to do what he says. He shared a tear and said, she don't understand. Got to stick to the plan. I owe everything to this man. Stays if you back to stay me. Got to sing your shades if we try to convey me. My heart sunk slow. The land door closed. Drew the mega bus and that was time to roll. Put him up. Thought I was in love before. Love you more. So baby, come aboard and go away with me. I can make you sing what you mean to me. We can be free. It's time for battle. Oh, wow. And it was fierce. She hit me in her side and left the armor pierced. And on a command, the fish attacked me. Got the mega buster, hit him exactly. But the battle took a turn that was odd. Every time I fired a shot, she didn't dodge. Took each blast from my yard cannon and smiled at me as every shot was landing. Thought I could say such was banded. Suddenly I started understanding. And yet, but this is letting me win. Giving me what I need so I can get to the end. By the 17 pitch, she began to stagger. Fell to the ground, so I ran and grabbed her. Looked her in her eyes, she tried to laugh. Pulled me close and enemy her step. Said I wish it didn't have to be like this. Thinking he might miss, and she be my miss. Then don't be foolish, you gotta do this. Let the whole city know what the truth is. And boy, you got stuff to do. Girl, I would've gave it all up for you. I feel the tits of moon when I'm holding you. Far as love goes, I'm over and soon put them up. Thought I was in love before, but I love you more. Come aboard and come away with me. Make you see what you mean to me. We can be free. Sing it if you know it. How's it go? Sing it if you know it. Come on, just you. Now when I say splash, you say splash, splash, splash. Now when I say splash, you say splash, splash. Now when I say splash, you say splash, splash, splash. When I say splash, you say splash, splash, splash. Yes. Once again, I am Mega Ran. Thank you so much. Thank you, Pax. Have a quick shout out. I see MC Front a lot over there. Thank you, MC Front a lot. I saw Adam Warrock. Thank you, Adam Warrock. Ladies and gentlemen, the low classics on the guitar. Alex. On the bass, Evan. Make some noise.
I'm Mega Rand. I'm going to go back out there. I'm going to be signing stuff and giving out free sweaty hugs. You guys are amazing. One time, make some noise for yourselves for being amazing. Thank you. Like I said, I never imagined myself here. I quit my job three years ago just to do what I loved. And so I have to say, man, anything's possible. So keep, keep on dreaming. dreaming. Peace, y'all. I'm Mega Rand. Love you.